So what if you're tired with flashing custom ROMs and want to go back to stock, like the one you had when you first bought it? Well, you're in luck. This is the easy guide on how to flash back to stock Hyper OS. The Virax TV. As you can see here, we have Infinity X ROM running Android 16 in our Poco F6 device. Now to start with, let's power off the device and reboot to fast boot mode by holding power and volume down simultaneously until the fast boot logo appears. Connect your device to computer via USB cable. Now on your computer, extract or unzip the HyperOS stock ROM you downloaded. After extracting the flashable file, we recommend moving the folder into your system drive or drive C. This minimizes errors during the flashing process. Once moved, copy the folder URL, then open the Xiaomi Mi Flash tool and paste the URL you copied. Now click refresh to check if your device is detected. Once detected, your device's serial will appear below. Here's the most important part. These options should be selected based on your objective. Option clean all and lock. If you want to flash and lock the bootloader. Option save user data. Flash back to stock, but user data will be saved. Note that most of the time errors and bugs occur due to version incompatibility. This option is not recommended. Option clean all. Flash back to stock, but you want to keep your bootloader unlocked. Once you've selected the right option for you, just hit flash to start flashing. you will get this similar result and status if you have successfully flashed the ROM. Your device will now auto reboot to system. Just proceed by setting up the device like the first time you got it. Here you go. We have successfully rolled back to HyperOS stock ROM from Infinity X custom ROM. If you like this video, we would appreciate your support by liking and subscribing. Cheers.